Hey everybody, welcome to Sunday's What's Possible. Um, uh, on the weekends, I try to keep keep these short, but um, usually it doesn't work out that way. So um, hopefully everything, all the games will be quick. But let's go ahead and see what, what we got for the B. I, I did do the B earlier in the morning. And I found 21 words. I think this is one of the shorter Bs. And um, at this point, uh, and I'm at the amazing level, level, which is like the third. And at this point, I'm going to look up the, the hints, the spelling B buddy. So you can see there are only 26 words. And... Um, Of which I have found, I think, 21. So I've got five words remaining. Um, and those are all mostly the B's and one L. Let's take a look at the stats. So the grade ones are the ones I still have to find towards the bottom. And there are those two of those kind of in the middle. So these are the A's. And here we go with the B's, lots of B's. And if you're wondering how I found Blin and Blini, uh, those are two Russian words. And I, uh, when I first started playing, I didn't know what those were. Those are like Russian pastries, desserts. And um, because I played this so many times, now I know, well, that it's part of the lexicon. And um, and also I found banana. <laughs> Usually, I, I I'm bad with fruits and um, like like banana, papaya, papaya, um, a coconut. Those are the ones that I miss out on. But today I did find these in, early in the morning. And let's look at the clues. A verse often set to music. <laughs> starts with a B A. That's a paisley uh, kerchief. Uh, oh, that's going to be bandana, I think. And that's going to be another spelling of bandana with a double N, I think. And speech sound. Oh, that's going to be bilabial because I already found labial. So that's going to be bilabial. Yeah. Okay, let's get those. And and I got to the second highest level. And with the double ends. Spellings can be tricky. I messed up with the spelling of fettuccine uh, a day ago and I had to look up the spelling of that. So that leaves just the narrative verse often set to music. Got all the H's. And the L's, I got a one there, one remaining there, relating to a person's sexual desire, libido, libid, libi something maybe. Yeah, libid, libidinal. <laughs> Tongue twister, L B, L I B I L. Yeah, I don't know how to. And that just leaves that one B, which is, um, um, if I get that, I get the queen B. And I've done really well over the past uh, many days for the for the B. I think I have like three queen Bs. Let's take a look at the stats. I got one, two, three. So if I get this, it'll be four. Um, and last week I did terrible. So, um, just one, I hope I get this, narrative verse, often set to music. That's got to be like a, hmm. See, sometimes thinking too hard can prevent you from getting 
or reaching the goal you desire. Um, so I'm going to just let it simmer, plan something else. And, and I hopefully it'll just come to me over the course of the day. And let's do, let's do Wordle. I'm on a 128 day streak. And where is my uh, stopwatch overlay? There we go. Let's start with the least. Hit that clock, press enter. Oh, wow. So we're down to like about 400 or 500 words. And I usually go with proud here, PR. O U D. Should I should I try something else? You know, I could go with choir. Let's try that. Oh, got two greens. Hmm. Ooh, should I aim for a birdie here? Because I've got one here, P-H-O-N-Y, phony. Okay, fingers crossed. Hey, hey birdie, wow. Wow, 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 wow. That was, uh, that was quite the thrill because I, um, I mean, that was just, just an inspired guess. And um, and it, it and and I got the body, so I'm very happy. Wow, that's a great one. Um, I usually always go with proud. So if I had gone with proud, um, I would have gotten P, and then not the H, and not the uh. Well, I've gotten an O as a yellow, and um, yeah, with proud too, I could have had a decent chance. Um, but I think choir definitely helped because getting those second and third, that really helps, I think. And, um, anyways, I'm, I'm very happy. So my streak is now at 129 and like a few days ago, I was getting a string of bogeys. So, and that notched it up to like 99 so if i get another bogey i'm going to be at 100 so that's something i'm trying to stay away from and so now let's try let's try uh let's try quartal and we got minty we got to reset that game clock and restart press Enter. Got the minty. Let's go with fresh. And then let's go with the board. Sort of pluck. I usually I go with pluck sometimes. I'm just trying to kind of you know mess it up a little bit. And now we'll go with pluck. Now, when I play quarter, it's 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 a game of elimination. Just trying to eliminate eliminate as many letters um, as possible by the fourth guess. And so now I can start guessing at the words. Today is tough because there aren't that many greens, more yellows. And so I'm going to try another one. Waver. And now with the third, I can go for a guess. So with the third here, I can go with um, 
rater r a t e r because the other way around t a r e r is less likely oh wow yikes i think i'm going to bust out here because i didn't get Oh, it was hater, not rater. Oh, gosh, gosh, gosh. See, I missed out the H there. I didn't look clean enough. It's a Sunday. It's a Sunday thing. Um, and because of that, I'm going to bust out here. Oh, that's just terrible. So it's going to be H-A-T-E-R there. Um, okay. So, that's okay. Let's see what else we've got. We got on the second, we got an F. F. Got an F there. So, it could be an E. Oh, it's going to be a felon. There we go. Got the second, but the first we've got a um, something that ends with A T, most likely A T E. Um, A T E. Yeah, the first one is going to be a little bit tough, I think. And then the fourth. Fourth is going to be. Oh, uh, let's see what's fourth. Um. Uh, Go with H. H. Oh, we go with R. R. Wow, today's quarter is tougher than usual. I've got, um, of course, I messed up there. Uh, we could go with TH, TH. And it's something E R T H W E R. So I'm trying to unjumble that T H W E R. Oh, it's going to be through. Ah, uh, T H R E W, through. So I can still try and get either the first or the third with this last guess. Well, I already know this one's hater. So let's try the first one. Um, And and 
that's going to be Something like this. I think it's going to be great. G R A T E, great. Nope. Agate. Yeah, you know, I was thinking of that, but I really didn't. I wasn't sure. So A G A T E, that's a tough one. And then I messed up hater. I should have gotten that. So, so my quarrel streak ends, and I'm back to eighty eight percent. And. Now, let's try the mini. Let's try the mini. Yeah, Sunday mini is usually easy. So, let's see how my friend did. Uh, 2 minutes and 39 seconds. So, I'm going to try and do as, as, as best as I can for those first 2 minutes. And let's head it off. Suitable for the occasion. Second option on Halloween. Halloween costume with a broom witch. Spooky. The upper echelon. Disney character who sinks. Petri dish. Overly cute. Twin. Megan. I think it's T. And that would be apt. Second option on Halloween. I don't know that. This I think is gonna be E. So if that is gonna be Eevee there. This is gonna be Overly quite cute. Tacit. Aerial. Oh, that's a treat. Trick or treat. Okay, I get that. And this is going to be elite. Yes, 206. I think I bested my friend. <laughs> How about that? Woo. But Sunday is usually easy. Um, um, Sunday is usually easy. And, um, you know, sometimes you can get it done in like 34, 35 seconds or like a minute. Um. But um, I did, like, Rich, Richard bested me on Saturday. He did it in a minute 58. I did I did it in 2.09. Friday, I still haven't had much luck with that. Uh, Thursday, he did better. Wednesday, he did better. I did better on Tuesday. And Monday, I still haven't gotten those. If I look at those, those are the ones there. I can 
try and see the 19th. Uh, uh, that one's going to take me a while. And that, I know it's that scuba thing device that I still don't know. Uh, and then um, this one frightened Texas qualifier funk chop lure don't know and then we've got this one Science fiction robot. Teapot. I think is this is this teapot? T E A. No, it doesn't. No. Oh, this is epoch. E P O C. See, I was thinking teapot here, and then teapot made me think it, it just rhymes with epoch. Kinda in the middle. So that's Epoch, and um, and so this one's wrong then. Not Yeah, it's not loops. That has to be Epoch. If I could get this similar. And this one with no fat. Science fiction robot. Apple Jacks. Oh gosh. Apple Jacks. That's it. I don't eat cereals anymore, so I don't remember all these cereal names. Apple Jacks. Okay. Apple Jacks. Now. If we could get a robot alike, alike, A L I K E, alike, yes. And Jack Spratt, Jack Spratt, yes, I think that's it. And then C was angry that day, my friends, yeah, like an old man, okay, old man in the sea kind of thing there. Modifying word. Adjective. Oh, droid. And that's going to be droid. D-R-O-I-D. Yes. So, it does help. Just, you know, sometimes when you have these um, minis or whatever games you're playing and, and it does, you don't get it right away, just wait for it and, and it'll come. It'll come. See? And everything's in the black. I didn't uh, have to use the check puzzle feature um, and I still managed to get it done in about seven minutes not bad I think all of these games if you can get it done between five to seven minutes that's pretty good you know over a cup of coffee or um, tea or uh, just a, a kind of you know if you're walking the dog uh, like I do and um, so I still have the 19th, 21st, and the 23rd. And now let's take a look at connections because I don't think I'm, I have anything for connections today because uh, kind of looks scary. I looked at it and I saw these, it jumped at me, fret, stew, brood, um, 
but I can't find the fourth one. Then I also saw Tron Challenge. Um, pose and face. I think those are kind of the four. If you want to do like a duel. So let's try with that. Okay, I got the green. Go up against. Um, and then we've got. Then I saw this jumble. Litter. Hash, kind of all the same, you know. Jumble it up, make a hash. Make a mess, litter, and then medley, a mix of it. Now, uh, which is going to, so today I haven't thought through the whole puzzle, I'm just kind of Taking it one step at a time. So let's see. One away. So I've got three of them correct. There's an odd one out there. Most likely it's going to be Medley, perhaps. Who knows? And um, Stu, Fret, Brood. Um, uh, there's another cat it could be, which is kind of brood, medley, litter, clutch, all like collective. A litter, a medley of, a brood, a clutch of. Let's try that. Nope. It's one away. Yeah, I'm going to mess this one up today, I think. <sighs> Connections can be very frustrating at times. Especially if you're not seeing it. When you see it, it's just great. You have this... Um, you feel wonderful, but when you don't see it, yeah, it sucks. <laughs> yeah, I've got two pips left. I'm going to try it. I'm going to, I'm going to um, give it a rest, let it simmer. So, so far, I've got Wardle, I've got, yeah, I only have Wardle, and I got the Mini. Um, so, Wardle and Mini, two, and then I might get the B, because I, I'm down to only one. Um, and I... And I probably will... Um, Yeah, I messed up the quartal, so. Uh, 
Okay, folks, sorry I'm being so slow today on a Sunday, um, but I'm going to pause it here and I'll come back to it, okay? Hey, hey, I'm back. Uh, you know, I've been thinking about that B word, the, the last word that that has me um, from getting the queen B, and I got it. Um, it is B-A-L-L-A-D, ballad, and I hope I'm saying it right. Um because sometimes, you know, it could be a French word or a, some other, uh, some word from some other language. So, you know, it, it, it could be said differently. So here we go. B-A-L-L-A-D. And I'm going to get the B, the Queen B. Woohoo! Awesome. And, um... <clears throat> And let's take a look at the stats. So we've got 26 words, found all 26. And here we go. Handbill was the pangram. Uh, pangram. And um, I think the hardest was for me. Uh, let's see, what was the hardest? Um, yeah, uh, libi, libidinal, um, let's, let's find out how do you say that, if I'm saying that right. Okay, I'm going to do a Google. Libidinous. Oh, okay. It went to something similar. Libidinal. Libidinal. Okay. So, um, when you look at these words, the words that you don't uh, know, you should always Google it and, and, and learn a little bit more. Especially, uh, um, I like this uh, where they tell you more about the history use over time and from 1800s to 2019 and um, I just love stats and stuff like that so and at this point I think I have now four out of five I've got the B I've got Wordle I got the mini uh, I didn't get Quartle so I got three three out of five um, and I'm still working on connections. I got the green and I got two pips left. I don't know why uh, this today's it's making me kind of brood over it or, um, or perhaps I'm fretting too much. Maybe I'll make a end up making a hash of it. Who knows? <laughs> um, I'm not going to stew over it. So. Uh, well, I am because, you know, I'm, I'm going to use um, uh, the nine hours that I've got left to figure it out, right? Um, so we'll see. We'll see what happens. So then I really don't have much time left uh, for the connections game to reset uh, in about 10, 13 minutes. And... Um, I'm just drawing a blank. Um, I just don't know. So here's what I'm thinking. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and select those squares or words which seem the most unlikely to belong to a cat category. And I think that's going to be the purple because usually the purple is the most difficult. Um, if you remember, I was saying clutch, litter, brood, hatch, and there was hash, fret, uh, stew, jumble, medley, all of those are kind of like, they're, they're all kind of uh, have overlaps. But I can't see anything between bridge, body, and neck. And so I'm going to go with those three, and I'm, then I'm going to select one. Um, probably I'm going to go with hatch, uh, because I think hatch... Uh, is the one that's most likely not to belong to the other two cats. And I'm going to go ahead and hit submit. 
and it's one way. Wow. I'm just getting these one ways um, for everything. And I've got only one pip left. And um, um, and I'm still thinking it's, I think I've got bridge, body, and neck right. And, um, and what do I go with? Brood. Yeah, we'll go with Brood. That's my last shot. Okay. Fingers crossed. Nope. That was the worst. Mishmash. I knew that. I knew the cat. Offspring. I knew the cat. Guitar parts. Oh, gosh. Oh, wow. I have a, I have a few friends who would have gotten that for sure. Um... I should have thought about it. The fret, fret being like um, that part of the guitar where you kind of strum, you know, the the, the 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 upper part, I guess, and then the body. I didn't think about the bridge, and I didn't think about the neck. It's definitely difficult, and um, so um, I've never really played the guitar. I I've played air guitar, but not the real guitar. And offspring, brood, clutch, hatch, litter, and I guess I messed that up. Um, thought I had something very similar. Oh, maybe I selected medley, brood, clutch, hatch, litter. Thought I had that, but um, we'll see. Um, it's just a game. It's okay, and so we will just be happy with uh, I think it was three out of five so there you go till uh, till Monday's uh, edition bye for now